Ring for the match and Corey Macklin. Corey. All right, Lance. Thank you very much. We're ready to go. One fall, 10 minutes in time for this next bout on USWA Championship Wrestling. First introducing 201 pounds from Nashville, Tennessee, Corey Williams. And his opponent at six foot seven, 295 pounds, Unified World Heavyweight Champion, Sid Vicious. One ball, 10 minutes. Kevin Christian is referee. Well, I see he's in the same charming mood today, Dave. Yeah, he's not a happy kid. Well, he's a little happier camper because he got some applause from the fans here. As Sid Vicious was asking for their approval, he, uh, he got a little bit of it. Oh, my goodness. Look at this. Man, Corey Williams fighting back. Look at him battle big Sid Vicious. Right then a left to the midsection, but doesn't phase Sid. Ooh, Corey ducks under. Oh, uh, no. Throttles oh. Uh, him down to the mat. And Corey Williams has already had a very, look at that face, has already had a very long day. Well, we talk about The Undertaker being scary. This guy's scary, too. Got to believe it. Take a look at that body and think you're going to be in there against him. I wonder if Corey Williams had any idea when he got out of bed this morning he was in for what he's in for. Power bomb. Hammer down by Big Sid. Puts one hand on referee Kevin Christian. One, two, three, and that is all there is to Corey Williams. And that match was Sid Vicious. You can't take it away from the young kid in there. He's no. just going against a superior force, admit it. He is just going against raw power in Sid Vicious. And I think maybe Sid Vicious is uh, serving some notice to us and everybody else who's watching. And that is that uh, Undertaker may be on the way. Maybe that match has been signed, but Sid doesn't appear to be backing up anyway. And you better believe he hadn't backed up from anybody. We're going to back up for just a moment and be back with more of the action here. The Undertaker with Paul Bear, Sid Vicious, the World Heavyweight Champion will be meeting him at the Mid-South Coliseum Monday night. And believe me, this is one, as Dave said, the crowd has been hollering for, and they've got it Monday night. Well, a challenger showed up, Sid. Well, see, Lance Russell, if you weren't blind, you would realize that a challenger showed up in this very studio last Saturday. And then he showed up Monday night. And where was he yesterday morning? He was at Baptist East getting a pin put in his shoulder. And we're talking about humongous. Okay, Lance Russell, your big grief with me has been Sid is always taking outside help. It's taking people from the outside to help you win. Well, I want you to realize and acknowledge one thing. See, for the last four to five weeks now, I have done everything I said I would do. And I have done it by myself. This the Undertaker. I have, to, I have to sit here and I have to wonder, what is the USWA doing? Are they so scared? Are they so scared of me, Sid Vicious, they have to go across the world somewhere and try to find someone my size with my gut? Well, see, it's not going to happen, Undertaker. You don't have a gut. See, as you sit in the ring with me, Paul Burr stands to the side of the ring and he holds all your guts in a thing called an urn. Well, see, my guts are inside here, Undertaker, and my guts are around, around my waist. This is Unified Heavyweight Championship belt, and it's something you'll never be able to take away from me, Undertaker. See, once, a long time ago, my friend, you also walked on the dark side, but you made a big mistake when you tried to become the fan favorite. See, I don't need to be the fan favorite. I am my favorite. Well, Sid, I, I want... I'm talking. I want you, pig, to shut up. Now, Undertaker, get back to you. 
come Monday night at the Mid-South Coliseum, you, my friend, will be laying on the mat after you experience something we call the power bomb. And as you look up at me, I will look down at you and I will say, my friend, my pale friend, you are just another victim. You hear this? It doesn't bother me because I welcome it with open arms, Undertaker. Now, you have to see if you can stand the wrath of Sid Vicious, the man that rules the world. Well, Sid, I don't know whether you remember it or not, but this is the guy that put Yokozuna in a casket. He's used to big ones. That's the Undertaker who will be down at the Mid-South Coliseum, a match you want to be able to tell everybody, I was there and saw it. Monday night, we're going to be back in just a moment.